this is an update of the Clarona 70 LED solar light this is to let you all know the problem that I encounter with this light that's why I changed and I put it I had a spare so I took this one out and put a spare in its place before I begin if you're new to, to this channel please like comment subscribe click on the bell icon to be notified of further videos let's begin to open the back of the light <clears throat> there are four screws here which I already take out there is a notch here you would lift the battery is held on by double sided tape that's why it's so hard this is the battery the problem i encountered <clears throat> with this light if you notice there are three breathing holes right here <clears throat> when the light is outside i notice it wasn't lighting so i thought it was the battery that was weak so i took out the light getting ready to change the battery what i found was ants build the nest in here the ants pass through these breathing holes <clears throat> that's three breathing holes the ants pass through these breathing holes and they settle on the border now what they did is they shot out the border the battery was all corroded the whole thing had ants nests and eggs so i decided to change it and have it inside i have this update to inform you all that have these lights it doesn't have to be that particular light but i believe all of them have the breathers if you have the light indoors it's all well and good but if you do have the light outdoors put grease down here or any other thing to block off the holes so ants won't get in and the light will last much longer what I did with this one I disconnected the panel I cut the wires, disconnect the panel, the solar panel, that's the solar panel here. And I bypass certain things on the border. I put this battery here. And I put this TP4056 charging module on it. So when this battery goes down all i have to do is charge it from here i put this switch here which means the sensor is not working this is not working because it's all the body shorted out all how i tried i cannot get it going so what i did was bypass everything and this is how I have it a switch and it comes on if the battery is dead you could charge it with any phone charger 
and I connect it like this to charge the battery. I have it set up as an emergency lighting system in my work station for if in case they take the power. So all you all have to do when you all do get a light before you place it outdoors take out the screws or you could leave the screws on and just dab some grease or paste to block these free holes that means the light won't be breathing but it will last you longer then you have insects crawling in and breeding and spoiling your light this is the update this is something you all have to look out for it doesn't have to be that light but any outdoor solar light you would have to block up the holes this is it for this video if you find the video was helpful please give me the thumbs up like comment subscribe until the next one goodbye Let go, you decide if you're